What's up everybody and welcome to update 1.9.3 for Last Day on Earth Survival. So, full disclosure, before I start the video, this is the alpha branch of the game. The update is not out to the public yet, I think it's due to be out next week. So I'm on the really buggy version. Well, don't know if it's really buggy yet, we'll find out I guess. So, new in version 1.9.3, farm. There's a new location in the game, Cook. Crooked Creek Farm. This location is constantly on the map and updated once in a couple of days. In order to get to the farm, you have to assemble a bridge over an infected stream. Don't worry, you won't need any turning machineries from electronic circuits. Planks, metal and something pretty simple will be enough. New zombies and boss. Good old raiders will keep you will keep you company <laughs> will keep your company at a country disco as well as new enemies, infected bulls, farmer zombies and their leader, Ravager. Get ready, there's going to be fight at going to be a fight at dances. A few grammatical mistakes there. New rewards. The further into the woods, the more attractive rewards become. When strolling through the new location, make sure to find a special box with a heavy lock. There's something interesting in it. You'll have to cut the lock there with the bench. Don't take it home with you. So I'm guessing we'll need to take a crowbar with us. And there's a chance of the gas tank drop in the bunker and you can find it in the farm as well. So let's head over to the broken bridge and see if we can get over to the farm. If I can get into the game. This might take a little while. I'll be back in a minute. Okay I'm back and here's the farm. Crooked Creek Farm. I thought this was the bridge, the little jetty here. I thought we were going to have to repair this and get out to this island but I'm wrong. It's just there that we've got to go to. So I think First off, I'm just going to run over there and see what we need to repair it. It's a red location. I like this. So it's like the bunker. In the alpha branch that I'm in, this location resets every three hours. However, it resets, I believe, every two days. So normally 48 hours for everyone else once the update comes out globally. But let's go and see what we need to repair the bridge. I'm guessing planks, rope, scrap metal and glue if the devs are horrible. I'm really hoping it's not glue. Ooh. Do we do we get a car engine? What's in here? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Energy drink. They've added Red Bull to the game. Okay, so one hammer. Oh, I haven't got a hammer. That's annoying. Right. Take a screenshot of this. I'm going to note it down. Is this the right chat? Yep. Okay, I'll be back here in a moment once I've got all of this stuff. It is going to take me a little while to find a hammer unfortunately because I've been using them all to try and upgrade my, what was it, upgrade the skull crusher. So I'll be back in a second. Welcome back people. So it's been about three seconds for you lot but it's been about an hour and a half for me because I had to refine all of these oak planks as well as some of this stuff but here we go. And yes, I do actually have all of it with me. I believe the rest is stored in the chopper. And I did, I completely forgot this when I was here earlier. But there's a hammer there, which is pretty cool. Free hammer. Perfect. Right, now I need just the rope. And I'm going to take the crowbar with me as well because it said something about opening a box. And I feel like the crowbar might be needed because you use the crowbar to open the gate in the bunker. Ta-da! I'm back again people, sorry about that, I had to put in a little cut there. It is actually the day after the last clip, because it was about 1am, I didn't realise the time. Alright, let's get these killed, there we go. So I got part way in, and then, yeah, realised the time, so just closed the game basically. Alright, so we've got Savage Giant there, which is a frenzy giant essentially but it does less damage and has less health so it's more like a toxic abomination oh they're pretty fast okay well let's get our uh, bone knife machete ready in place okay so one thing I know the piles of hay that big one there zombies can crawl out of it so you want to try and avoid them if you can oh I can hear some farm equipment Okay, got an angry, frenzied savage thing. And we've got a zombie just roaming around there, doing its own thing. Not really sure what it's doing. Right, so I want to try and get the sneak with the Diablo saw blade. Ah. Oh, that's weird that I can sneak up on it. 
Okay, so this could end up being pretty devastating. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Shooting here, unless you're careful. Oh. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. Alright, let's give this another go. Ignore my chat in the bottom there. I can say hi to 007. Wait, how do I do this? Uh, I, I want to use the chat feature in game. Private message. Hang on, I can do this. Howdy. No, that's Gaudi. Howdy. Hi, Christopher. Message not reckless that used. Okay, well, I tried at least. Right, so I'm just coming in armed to the teeth. All I've learned is that. Ooh, that AK sounds different. And there's an infected wolf here, of course. Oh, there's lots of them. Why wouldn't there be infected wolves? I guess it is a farm. Oh my god, there's so many. I'm guessing this is what was chasing me before. Was that a 17 hit there? I think that was. I like the new sound for the AK. I think it's pretty good. Bit annoying that they don't drop anything, so it's not. They don't, like, drop tickets or anything. Which is sad. Okay, so I need to try and get to my dead body and not die to the giant bear thing. Bull. That was it. Right, now. Savage giant. Let's take this guy on. Hey, didn't miss a single shot there. Okay, so I have got a flood of them coming after me again. Oh, and I've got raiders attacking me as well. Absolutely brilliant. Why are there raiders taking sides of the zombies? You're supposed to be enemies. Damn it. Taking your AK. Not taking your saw blade. Oh, it's a... Why wouldn't it? What? Why is there a 2,000 health zombie here? Oh, and I'm missing all my shots on it. What? Why is there a 2,000 health zombie? I do not want to get hit by him. I am not laying that anywhere near me. So I'm guessing this is the new boss that it set about. Although it seems pretty easy to kill since it goes the speed of a roaming zombie. This is this is weird. Is it just here to chase you out, maybe? Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh right. Oh dear. Um medkit use. There we go. Okay. Ah, oh, my make it switched into the wrong slot. That explains it. Let's do this. Okay, so I do want to try and get my inventory back. There we go. Um, just quickly. You know what? Uh, this should be good, but I'll switch out that saw blade. Right, I'm not going to try and take on the bull at the moment. That does not sound... Okay. Oh, we found the farmhouse. Okay. So this location is actually a lot bigger than I was expecting it to be. Right. Hey, we're in. <gasps> There's another puppy. Okay, I'm going to delete this almost broken Glock. And I'm going to take a puppy. Hey, so I've already got two puppies from this place. And there's actually some good loot here, possibly. Ah, not that good. Um, I could eat a bit of meat. Right, so... Ah, okay. How... I th ah, requires iron hatchet, so I have to break through there. But I think that was a bug that it went invisible. Yeah, so I've got to come back here with an iron hatchet to work out what's going on. But, we can carry on nonetheless. Guess this is... I oh know, it's not a big one. There we go. Ooh, what's this? Farm chest required. Ooh, is that the farm chest up there? Hmm. How do I... How do I get in there? I don't know how to get in. And I can hear zombies in there too. Do I maybe have to move this stuff out of the way? But I can't... 
Huh. Okay, my shotgun broke. Uh, I got confused why I was suddenly shooting really slowly. Really fast, I mean. Right, okay. So this is... This is going to take a while to get the hang of, actually. And I like it. It's nice they've added something cool and new. Okay, another bit of loot here. wonder if we can get one of the new food items, because is there a new food item, actually? I might be completely wrong. Okay, nothing that special. I think I might have to go and take on the bear. Not the bear, the bull. Or whatever it is. I think I'm gonna give it a go. Should I do it? Let's get healed up to back. Okay, 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 okay. And everything's on cooldowns. Oh dear, this isn't going good. Alright, so the infected bull. Not that fast, as the dev said. Oh wow, the range on this is pretty bad now. And what's he going to drop for us? Nothing! He didn't drop us anything! I feel cheated. Oh, that's disappointed. So there are actually a couple oak trees here, if you want to be farming up some oak. Oh, that's cool, the swing swings. <laughs> that's awesome. Right, but... How? How, how, how am I supposed to get into here? I can't work this out. I'm going to have to tab out and actually try and ask one of the devs or someone else. See if I can find out. So I'll be back in a second. And I'm back, people. So, I found this box and I've been told that once you place the box in that thing that said place the box here, then in theory that door will open. Or so I'm told. But I think zombies come out and we have to kill them, which will suck a little bit. But, jeez, oh, you walk so slow with this. I wish I could drive around on my chopper. It would just be so much easier. Stick the chopper on the back and drive around. Take the box straight over. Just say stick the chopper on the back. Wow. Right, whereabouts is it? I can't even remember. So I do like this farm place, but I think it's... It might take a few too many guns. I'm probably doing it in a really efficient way, in a really inefficient way. So I'll wait until some of the more knowledgeable slash game smart YouTuber people start making a few guides on it, so I can work out how I'm actually supposed to be doing it. It looks really weird. My feet are kind of sliding along the floor a little bit as I walk. <laughs> I like it. Right. Yeah, it's up here. Perfect. Okay. So, wonder if I can. No, I can't use that ladder. That's a shame. Here we go. Are they coming? Come on. Alright. Okay, so there's actually quite a lot. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay, I could there better be something good in this box. It's like the shipwreck all over again. Okay. Oh, I wish I had the shotgun equipped. Okay, yeah, it's alright. We're getting there. We're getting there. Did I just get a miss on a Glock? I didn't think that was possible. Yeah, you got a 27 on a Glock. A hey, last one. Perfect. It is disappointing that they don't drop anything. I feel like they should have like some tickets or something that you can use in a normal bunker. Right, where am I going? Hey! There's another puppy! That's a third puppy! <gasps> Ooh, so this is where you can possibly get the gas tank. Let's see. Hey! Didn't get a gas tank, but that's still a nice load of loot. Right. Yep, I have space for you, puppy. You're coming with me. Ah, oh, we got a puppy. Right then. Ooh, what's this? Aramid string. Okay, so we've got a better string blueprint. Oh, we've already actually used that blueprint. That's disappointing. Ooh. With this magazine, helps you learn about other survivors' bases and get exploration experience for them. Hell yeah. There we go. And what else we got? 
Oh, we got a new scythe. Perfect weapon for some grim reaping. <laughs> and we got a shotgun as well. Oh, this is pretty cool. I like this. So this is, yeah, it's basically like a yellowish ticket crate. Right, I want to see if I can find a zombie to scythe. Don't know, even know if there are any left alive, actually. That's a bit disappointing. Oh, yeah, there's something I need to get from over here. Is it in this one? Nope. I believe it's in the next one down then. I found something incredibly useful that I need a lot of at the moment. Ten cool person points to whoever can guess it. That's a glue. Ah, but I haven't got any room for it. Okay. Right, I'm going to... I'm going to probably end off the episode here. I'm going to try and do a more informative video about the farm now that I've gotten the hang of it. Well, now that I know a bit about it. So, thanks for watching, people, and I'll see you next time. Bye!